guys, this is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading for the week of June 6, 2022. Thank you guys for stopping by. Please remember these are general readings, so take with you what resonates and leave what does not behind for someone else. If you're seeking a personal reading, it is JackieTomlin.com. And the focus today is on what Sagittarius needs to know for the week of June 6, 2022. So Sagittarius, first card up. Sagittarius, temperance card. Temperance says that when you do the same thing, you get the same result and you recognize that. So you're changing things up. You're shifting your energy. You're doing things differently and you're getting a better result. And to be quite honest with you, I think a lot of you are going to be dealing with another Sagittarius this week. We have the Nine of Pentacles, financial independence. This is also money coming in. It's not, it's new money, but it's money that I think that you may know about. So this could be some type of inheritance. Um, this could be some kind of settlement coming in, something that you may know about, okay? So new money, but not new to you, okay? Knight of Pentacles coming in with a good, strong business deal is going to come rushing in. Some kind of offer is coming in. Some of you, it may be some kind of side hustle or something of that effect, but it's definitely some new money coming into play. And we have the Five of Cups. Five of Cups. Sagittarius, you're guilty of this. Get out your head. You're overthinking things. Don't overthink things. Don't overanalyze things because you drain your energy when you do so. And on the center of the reading bonus we have the ten of pentacles this is the abundance card now not only is this the highest financial card in the deck this is abundance in general health wealth family friends it's everything okay it's good luck and abundance and here we have the six of wands and this is total victory and success this also indicates that you're going to be in the spotlight you may have an audience you may be doing some public speaking Maybe a tarot reader. Who knows? But this does indicate total victory and complete success, which is coming in under the um, the Knight of Wands and the Good Business Deal. With that, there it is. Seven of Pentacles working and gaining. I really feel that some of you are about to get another job offer or something different. There's some kind of offer of employment here. And we have the Page of Pentacles as well. I think we've got about every pentacle I can think of here. Page of Pentacles, same thing, coming in with a good business deal. This could also resonate as a Capricorn energy, okay? But definitely something cooking up with the money, something, something different. It's not your regular job, okay? And there is a warning of three as a crowd, third person, unwanted advice and or opinions. Someone trying to get into your business is what I'm seeing. Someone is wondering, maybe it's because you have all these offers and there's some jealousy surrounding you. Someone is digging into what you're doing and what you're up to. And I really want to say someone wants to know what you're up to. That's what I'm seeing. Okay. So let's move forward with these messages. Okay, so we're going to start up top with that temperance card. With that, you have the Queen of Swords. You may be dealing with a Virgo. Um, this may also just be some person that has that know-it-all type energy about them. Um, don't, no confrontation, you just need to know that it's present. And then we have the Queen of Pentacles. And with that Queen of Pentacles, we have the Seven of Wands. My favorite card, this is the, the you card. This says that you've been doing the journey inward. You've been working on yourself. You've been expanding your horizons. And it's getting ready to pay off. It's getting ready to pay off in a big way for you. Okay, and then we have that Knight of Pentacles. Brings in the world, as in the world is your oyster. This is really good energy. On the Five of Cups. Sag is the Hermit card, the Wisdom card. The Hermit card says, you know, things may feel a little strange around you or a little chaotic, but bottom line is you're on the right path. You're doing what you're supposed to be doing for the time being. On the Ten of Pentacles, we have the King of Wands, Aries Energy. Uh, someone in authority, someone uh, maybe in a uniform, someone coming in, someone that really wants to assist you, okay? Someone who really wants to be there for you and someone who wants to help you out. Could also be a Leo, 
uh, you're definitely dealing with another fire sign of Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius this week. On the Six of Wands, we have, again, Temperance. Sagittarius and Sagittarius. Wow. Okay. Changing things up, doing things differently, and getting a positive result. It's almost like an instantaneous result when you do so. On the Seven of Pentacles, we have the Fool card energy. Happy, go lucky, carefree, doing you. Be warned of foolish decisions, but bottom line, Sagittarius, this is all indicating that you're getting ready to take a leap of faith. And on the Page of Pentacles. The Star. Wish Fulfillment. Total happiness, total contentment, but it's also saying that any delays that occur the week of June 6th are just in your favor. Now, on that Three of Swords, of that someone knows it in your business is the Ten of Pentacles. There's jealousy surrounding this, okay? The Ten of Pentacles has appeared twice. Uh, this is your abundance. I think the person knows it around trying to be in your business. It's a lot of jealousy going on here, okay? And on the center of the reading bonus, we have, oh, sorry, pull two. Seven of Pentacles again, working and gaining, growing your money, planting the seed, and the Two of Swords saying you've got decisions to make that you've been putting off for too long. Bottom line is really positive energy. The, the work you've done on yourself is paying off. Everything shows you're on the right path. You're taking the leap of faith and you're leaving a trail, trail of jealousy behind you. Thank you guys for watching. JackieTomlin.com if you're seeking personal readings. And I will be available all week. So have a great week. See you soon. Bye.